Hey everybody, Ann here, sitting in the tiny house, having my coffee with all of you guys. And today is going to be a beautiful sunny day. It's going to be hot, but it's going to be plenty of sunshine. So if I need to turn on the air conditioner, I can run it for about an hour on solar, so that's good. Um, oh, I wanted to show you something from last night. This is awesome with the baby chicks. Well, look at that. For the first night, they have come up into the coop on their own. They didn't expect me to do it. They did it. I'm bending over and filming at the same time. Sorry. You go, chickens. I'm so glad I don't have to go chase them down anymore. They'll just go up there by themselves. Anyhow, I'm tired today. I didn't sleep very well last night. Um, but I'm going to get something done. Something done today. I've got the cherry tomatoes out dehydrating again. But the first thing that I want to check is those jars to see if they sealed. Alright, here they are. Sealed. Whoops. Sealed. <laughs> so far, so good. Sealed. 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 And sealed. I did it, you guys. I did it. Stewed tomatoes. I did it. I could have put a little bit more in there, but look at I did it, you guys. My goodness, just got home. Uh, took Mr. Lucas to the dump and he rode along with me to town to sit in the truck with Papa with the air conditioning on so I could run into the grocery store and uh, get some things. I got some ice. Anyway, uh, I, I really hope those tomatoes are going to be done dehydrating today. I'm going to go check them here in a second. But I'm sitting here on my porch and I noticed something beautiful over there. Look at passion fruit flowers. Aren't they the most beautiful thing? Oh my gosh, they're just so pretty. Look at that. I don't know if I'll get any fruits, but there's going to be a lot more. And look at how good they're growing. They're kind of wilty right now because it's the heat of the day. But they are definitely growing. As well as these over here. Yeah, we're going to get blooms eventually as well on these. I'm so glad these made it. Look at it, it goes all the way over there. I decided to do a little tiny project and I just wanted to cover this up with something that wasn't painted. Um, so I was at Dollar General and they had, no, Family Dollar. They had these. Um, they're selling them as like floor planks, but yeah, they're very, very thin, very thin. So I don't know if this would ever work on my floor, but I wanted to get a box of them because I had a couple different ideas. I had considered even maybe using it for the ceiling, but these are just too, there's no way, there's no way. But it did make a very nice covering for this little area over here. I think it looks great. It was easy to put down. I just, you, easy to cut. I think that's pretty awesome. I will use this again for more projects. Um, just not on the floor, not on the ceiling, not on the walls. Just for little projects like this. I think it looks great. What do you guys think? I think it looks great. And I decided to do the top of this ice chest. I don't know if it'll stick because it's kind of like an uneven pattern on the top of it. But, um, you know what? It can be used as a chair, as a table. Um, I need to cut some more pieces and trim it up a little bit more. But... I don't know. I kind of like it. But I really, really dig this. Yep, it's smooth. It wipes clean. And I don't have to worry about the paint coming off. The only thing that I'm curious about is whether or not it's really going to stick or if it's going to start coming up. It's okay. That box only cost $11. So I figured it's worth a try. This has been going all day. So I'm going to kind of reach my hand in there and see... Um, some of them are done. 
yeah, they're just about done. I think I'm going to bring them inside overnight and feel them in the morning. And if they get any of the moisture back because it's so humid, uh, I'll just put them out here another day. I am so beat, you guys. I really didn't do all that much today. I, you know, hauled some buckets of water and uh, watered the garden. Um, like I told you before, I went into town with Mr. Lucas. Uh, but I'm tired. So, uh, nothing else is going on. Um, I'm very happy that the jar is sealed. I feel confident that I'm going to be able to do a lot of canning successfully. Um... But nothing else is going on, so let's just make this one a short one for reals this time. That's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.